Hey guys, what do you call it when you get really close to something but don't actually reach it? Um, edging. No ice, I mean in math. It's called taking a limit, bruh. I'll say less, I actually know what this is, bae. Let me lock in. So a limit is the value that a function approaches as it nears a certain x value. Here's an example. I say it like the limit as x approaches two of x squared. So yes, that is what a limit looks like. In some cases, like here, we can plug the x value we are approaching into the function to get the limit. So the limit here is four, but this doesn't always work. Look at these examples. We can't just plug our x value in because that results in division by zero. Yeah, duh. To keep it a hundo, it doesn't really matter if the function is defined at the x value you are approaching. You just want to know what is happening to the function as it approaches the x value. So even though there is a hole in this function at x equals 5, the limit as x approaches 5 is 2. Precisely icy. To evaluate these limits, we can use techniques such as factoring, multiplying by the conjugate, finding a common denominator, or even low p tall's rule. Wow. Obama. You're him. One last thing. There are cases when the limit does not exist. This is when the value the function approaches from the left or negative side is different than the value the function approaches from the right or positive side. Yes, so here the left-handed limit as x approaches 1 is 1, and the right-handed limit as x approaches 1 is 2. Since these values are not equal, the limit does not exist, or DNE. Subscribe.